Beginning tonight, Philadelphia police are quite literally rolling out a new effort to tackle crime. In response to a spike in incidents like this one, from car meetups to crowds fueled by social media, the department is deploying what they call the mobile surge team. Though they won't detail how many, we're told it'll involve a lot of police officers, all focused on responding when and where they're needed. Action News reporter Charles Watson live at police headquarters tonight. Charles, this was welcome news to many you spoke to today. Yeah, Brian, indeed, it was welcome news to a lot of the folks we spoke to who live and work in high crime areas. Now, at the moment, it's unclear where the mobile search team will begin its work tonight, but the Philadelphia Police Department says folks can expect a large number of uniformed officers who will definitely command a lot of attention. When Mayor Parker took office, she spoke about her city plan, um, and one element of that was making the city safer. That starts tonight when the Philadelphia Police Department's new surge team hits the ground running, tackling lawlessness in some of the city's most crime-ridden neighborhoods. So that focus is going to be hitting those, those hot spots that we know we have violent crime. The department says that will include using data to deploy the surge team to different problem areas every Friday and Saturday evening for the remainder of the year. They'll also help to disperse large unruly crowds and cars meetups. Having the cops here more often on the weekend will really, really be extra help for us. It's unclear where the strategy will unfold first, but some folks like Jahara Cruz, who lives in Kensington and works in this auto parts store, say it's a much needed extra layer of protection for her and co-workers who have had issues with drug use in front of their store. And with us having some more officers in the hood, yeah. Could do a little bit better. The owners of Cantina La Martina say this could be the perfect opportunity to help restore Kensington. You park your car, open the door, and someone's there using drugs. I think that is more dramatic for everybody. They tell Action News drug use, shootings, and open fires have scared customers off and really hurt the restaurant. And while they welcome extra officers, they say they want crime fighting efforts to be done holistically, something they say Mayor Parker promised. Our only hope is that that approach is taken when providing solutions to the community. Yeah, and so the mobile search team will be deployed every weekend for the remainder of the year, but the Philadelphia Police Department says it will not hesitate to change its strategy or the days it deploys the team should it have to. For now, we're live in front of police headquarters, Charles Watson, Channel 6, Action News. Brian? Yeah, a lot of people hopeful this is the beginning of a much-needed change uh, in the city. Charles, thank you.